Hey, top of the morning, gang. What's poppin' with y'all, man? It's your boy, Connor Slaughter. Y'all already know what's up. Go ahead and hit that like button, man, while we up in here, man. Run y'all the intro. You know what up, though. Man, you bitch niggas better end your butt elevate. I need six figure money. Won't have the bucks and hella cake. Fuck boy, I've been on dummy. Shootin' hella ops, make them a day. If not him, then kill his mama. Make him feel his wrath in the hell away. Hydro shock, but it's out. Make him his chest watch as they swim away. I don't stop shooting till you die in your last breath, and then I skid away. This a hollow tip. Gang, what's popping with y'all, man? You know, welcome back. Top of the morning to you kings and queens out there. Hopefully all y'all blessed by the best, man. I'm only here to tell y'all to control your emotions, man. You see what the title say? Control your emotions, gang. Too many emotional people out there, man. Too many emotional men, definitely. Emotional women also. Um, and we know women supposed to be emotional, so I can't even put them in the category uh, that I'm placing the men in. But it's too many emotional men out there. You know, y'all cats be killing me. You know, half soft, half y'all want to talk about another man business all day. Uh, uh, you know, you want to front niggas off. J-Man, definitely you, man. You went in front of uh, King Yellow off like that, gang, when they did that, that damn interview on Adam 22. Front like a motherfucker. And that's another thing. People be fronting out here. See, I don't think half of us got to be that emotional as men just to front another man off. That ain't life. That ain't something you want to you know what i'm saying partake in on your regular on your average day you want to make yourself a front of a jealous ass nigga an envying ass nigga no i don't think so i wouldn't want to make myself no jealous envying ass hating ass nigga you know but it's niggas out here like that because they get too emotional emotions get them caught up in such a hole you feel me where they get lost and now you know can't be found you feel me? They, they can't even find themselves, and that's fucked up because as a man, you don't even supposed to be holding those type of feelings, gang. You know, you don't supposed to uh, bear those type of feelings within yourself. Fuck around with you. I see too many men doing that, man. Some of the biggest men, some of the richest men, some of the, you know what I'm saying? The ones who supposed to be all high and mighty. Like, dog, you see these niggas time after time again. You know, they get emotional. They get real sissified. They get real crybaby-like, man. You know what I'm saying? You ain't showing the youth nothing. You ain't showing me, myself, how to be a man. Half of the time, I'm younger than half of you niggas out there, gang. And half of you niggas out there be pussies. <laughs> Pure pussies. I don't know if it's, it's, it's in you or if this is what you picked up along your journey along the way. But half of you niggas be pussy out there, man. Too emotional. You caught up in your feelings like a bitch. Um, you want somebody to cater to your feelings. You feel me? And then the person you want to cater to your feelings is a nigga. That's what's funny. And I'll be looking at you niggas like that, man. Like, dog, too many hard legs, no soft legs. You need to be around more women. You feel me? Not to be emotional, but to be around more women and not them niggas because y'all emotions be leading towards the niggas. That's sweet as hell. That's gay. I'm just saying, no disrespect to the LGBTQ community or whatever the case. Um, But <clears throat> for the man, man out here, man, that's sweet. We don't want that. You feel me? Y'all got to decipher that and stop being so scary. Decipher that, man. It's, it's, it's a differential line between the two. You feel me? Yeah, because these girls and boys out here got to be raised, gang. They got to know what they want to be in life, a man or a woman. And to be a man, you got to be a manly man. You got to be a manly man, a real man. You feel me? One that's going to come home to his family, provide for the family, take care of the family, secure the family. You feel me? Feed the family and teach the family. One that's going to be working, not beating on his woman or his wife, you feel me? Not using her, not cheating on her, not taking her for everything she got or taking her for granted, you feel me? That's what we need out here, gang. I want to see that my, myself. I be looking forward to seeing men out here like that because, like I said, man, I be trying to see the next best generation of men and women. And hopefully it can be the ones that's coming up, hopefully. We can teach them. You feel me? That's what I'm looking forward to. I don't, I don't really see nobody out there talking like this, but, you know, I'm looking forward to hearing somebody talking like that sooner or later. Shout out to 19 Keys. I hear him talking like that. Shout out to Hassan Campbell. I hear him talking like that. You feel me? Um, uh, shout out to Identicals and, and, and uh, shout out to Sub-Zero Podcast. I hear him and Rosie talking like that, you know? There's a couple cats out there, man. Shout out to King Yellow. I hear him talking like that. You feel me? Uh, you know, all those great men, you feel me? Those real great men who be fathers. Shout out to Boosie. Boosie badass. I hear him talking like that. I hear a lot of group of fathers that be in their kids' life. You feel me? We need to do that as a challenge. We need all these rap artists, gang, and every other artist around the world or every celebrity around the world to do a challenge, gang, to where we see a video or a photo of you and your children. You feel me? You active 
in your children's life. You actively active with your kids. You feel me? A short or something. That's what I like to see. And and and, and that'll show me that it's a difference being made because it'll show me that somebody out there listening, you feel me? Yeah. I'm always active in my kids' life, gang. You're going to see me always active. I'm going to always stay popping with them. We're going to stay doing shit, and we got more shit to do. That's what I'm telling y'all YouTube people to turn us up because I got more videos coming so I can upload for y'all so y'all can, you feel me, watch me and my family, how we be a family, a black family at that, and that's the greatest thing, being a black family. You feel me? You don't see too many black families together. You feel me? Like me and my wife, we take these kids, man, and we do the best we can do. Usually it's the woman, though. She got a lot of details, so she know how to set things up, activities up. You feel me? For um, And I love that. Mm. I like participating in it and everything. So it makes me more, you know, in tune with myself as a family man, as a, as a, um, I get in tune with the feminine side of a man. You know what I'm saying? Not, I ain't talking about no zesty shit. I'm talking about the feminine side of, you know what I'm saying? Submitting to my woman. You feel me? Submitting to whatever it is that she want to do. Submitting to my kids and finding out what they want to do. They might want to draw something on the sidewalk with chalk. They might want to go for a bike ride or a walk through the park or anything. You feel me? That's being a man right there, man. Not pulling no trigger out here on the corner, shaking dice, gambling. You feel me? Hating on the next nigga, hoping your brother, the same color as you, don't uh, make it past you or surpass you or make it nowhere near you. That's hating. That ain't being a man, my nigga. That's poor excuse of a man. But anyway, I ain't gonna hold y'all too long, man. I love y'all. Y'all make sure y'all stay safe out there, gang. You feel me? I am out. Watch your circle before they murk you. And move like you been hunting, man. Move like the FBI is chasing you, nigga. Move like, you feel me? You got the world chasing you, nigga. You feel me? I'm gone, gang. I love y'all. Gang, gang, gang. What's up, man? This your boy, Carter Slaughter, man. Welcome back to the Street University. I'd like to thank all y'all who came out, you know, gave me a little bit of your time by coming to my channel. Both channels watching the video. I really appreciate y'all, man. And those of y'all that did not hit the subscribe button as you step in, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Those of y'all that did not hit that like button as you step in or step out, you feel me? Make sure you hit that like button on the way out. Make sure my views match my likes gang so y'all can keep me in the algorithm and keep me moving and grooving you feel me how y'all have been doing man i appreciate y'all y'all already know i love y'all without y'all it wouldn't be me so man i'm out